Welcome to a Cruising with Ted video production featuring Captain Ari on board the bridge of the Regent Seven Seas Grandeur. Cruising with Ted, now we're going to go into the bridge. Um, let's go ahead and see what's happening here on the bridge of the ship today. Oh, hello. Hello, sir. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Okay. What's going on here today, Captain? Captain Eris, correct? Yes, sir. My name is Captain Ari. Welcome to our beautiful ship. We are at sea and this is from where we navigate okay. our beautiful vessel. Really? Wow. I've never been on a bridge like this before. It's a very interesting setup. As you can see, we have uh, the steering wheel is over there in front in that control. We have this uh, horseshoe shaped console that includes all the main consoles, the radars, uh, electronic charts, uh, screens that they show us, the speed, uh, the direction, and all the important information we need uh, to navigate the ship. The steering wheel, sorry, is not the old fashioned big uh, wooden uh, steering wheel. Where's the wheel. steering wheel? It's over there. Let's it's take a look at that. Show me that steering wheel. Okay, this is the steering wheel. This is where the quartermaster stays and uh, steers the ship. Based on the instructions, the orders he receives from uh, the navigator. The navigator is the one who navigates the ship. And these are the two seats. The seat of the navigator and the seat of the co-navigator. We may make an example if on an aeroplane, you have the pilot and the co-pilot. On the cruise ship, with this setup, you have the navigator and the co-navigator. Okay, do you mind if we sit over there and take of a look? Of course not, that? yes, let's go. All right. So what am I looking for here? <laughs> oh, you don't use these? We do use them, yes. What, what do you uh, use binoculars for? The binoculars, we use them in order to uh, identify any, uh, we call them targets, meaning any ship that crossing our bow, uh, coming close to ours. And uh, all the time we have people on board the bridge 24 seven that we need to monitor. Okay. Can you control what are some of the functions you have here? Currently, we can control the direction, the course of the ship, and of course, the speed. Okay. Uh, at this moment, we are in autopilot. Autopilot? Yes. So the ship oh, yeah? is getting controlled by an autopilot. Of course, it's very easy and fast if we want to take over the, the steering of the ship. I showed you earlier the steering wing. Yes. Another way that we can change, alter the course of the ship is from this little joystick here. From here? Yes. I sir. shouldn't touch that then, right? Yeah, you can touch it, but don't mess with it. Okay, so... Um... So, as we're saying, these are, we call them targets, of course, are at the other ships that they are sailing uh, around us. So, from our radar, we can get some very important information uh, such as the course, the speed of the ship, even the name, as well as something which we call CPA and time CPA. CPA means closest position approach and time CPA it's after how many minutes um, the target will pass by the closest 
uh, position from, uh, from us. For example, this ship right here, we can see that there is a CPA of two nautical miles, which is quite a safe distance uh, to pass from each other. Needless to say that if the CPA is zero, means that both ships are in a collision course. And at that time, we have to communicate with each other, alter our course and pass um, in a safe distance. Where are we going now, Captain? Okay, now we're going to my office. Okay. You're so off. this is my office wow, yeah. and my cabin as well. This is where I sleep. Okay. And this is my my small office. I have my computer. As you see, I have a, a, a radar screen, a display that uh, keeps me aware uh, okay. all the time where the ship is, where we go. And of course, the compass. Wait, what is our course that we always follow? So, Captain, tell me a little bit more about how you got into the uh, this maritime industry and uh, and what's going on with you know how you develop your skills and talents to um, fulfill your own dreams and purposes in life. Go ahead. Very good. Uh, I don't. Uh, I didn't have the opportunity to grow up uh, with a, a profession which was related with a job at sea. My father was a military officer. He spent 36 years in the Greek uh, army. And uh, I had several influences from, uh, from him while I grew up. Um, after I was 18 years old, uh, I decided that I have to do something with my life. Traveling around Greece while I was uh, growing up, always I had a big love for the sea. And uh, this is how the cruise ships uh, appeared into my blue clear horizon. And uh, I gave some exams, I passed, I joined the Merchant Navy Academy. And uh, that was my final decision. From the moment that I have started uh, working on cruise ships, uh, I never looked back. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, what is your message to people out there that are interested in uh, maritime jobs? Um, what what would you have to say to them in terms of what the future looks like and and how they can get involved in such activities working at sea it's uh so working at sea is um, is an amazing uh uh, life uh, can give you so many things, travel the world, see new places, uh, meet people. Uh, it's a job, of course, that takes a few things from you. You are away from family. Uh, you miss a lot of uh, family moments. Uh, but still, if you ask me, I totally uh, recommend for people to follow this uh, career, this, uh, this path. And thank you so much. And what would you like to say to, um, I have a lot of viewers out there um, they may not have been on an electric cruise before, or maybe they have cruised other electric cruise lines. Maybe they haven't tried Regent yet. Um, from your experience, what would you like to say to them? Um, how would you invite them on board? If you want to be with the best, and uh, start uh, your cruising experience from the top, you definitely choose uh, Regent. All right. Thank you so much. Anything else you want to add? Uh, come cruise with us. It's a great pleasure to welcome you on board and uh, looking forward to see you somewhere around the world on board, uh, on board the Regency. Thank you so much, sir. Ted thanks Captain Ari for his gracious hospitality and invites you to scan the QR code to receive exclusive travel offers.
join our Facebook group, Ted's Fans of Regent Seven Seas Cruises. Go to cruisingwithted.com for all your luxury travel needs. Please subscribe to Ted's YouTube channel, Cruising with Ted.